Hello, let's do the Daily Polygonal, number 163, for January 10th, 2023. And today we've got a sandwich going on here. So we have a repeated letter here, and it's surrounded by a repeated letter. And then that's it. It's a seven-letter word. Hmm. So... I don't know why, but T-E-E-T -E -E is... like So we can do like S-T or something. That feels pretty nice, but... I don't know how to end... I don't know what steet is, and I don't know how to end it. So maybe not. Um, it could also be a vowel and then like any any number of double consonants and then another vowel. Um, let's look at ing because that that would tell us the i repeats. Like filling? That seems perfect. All right. Well, I think there's a lot of options here. We have a g. Hmm. I almost want to repeat the g here, but probably not. But. What would that be? Like, I uh, can't do like nagging or anything like that. I can't end in ing anymore. Um, oh, this is a really unfortunate situation where now it's harder to think of a word that works and I don't have enough information to logic it out. And so I end up using a filler anyway, but what if it was like gr? No. No, definitely not. What about like G, E, and then something repeated, E, A, D, I don't know. I'm, I'm grasping here. Could be a plural. If it's a plural, we can end in E, G, S, or really any vowel here. Um, not, I'm just not seeing it. I'm going to have to do a filler. Machine is not intact. Poultry... Poultry is not very intact. I wonder if I can think of a filler that tries to place the G somewhere. Um, I could use two Gs to see if it's the repeated letter. What would that look like? End in like G-E-R. This is my thought. Taggers. Common letters T, R, S. We're trying the E. We're trying the A. Both in one of these repeat slots that I think are, are going to end up a vowel. And then we're testing if there's a double G. If it's yellow, yellow, then we know where they go. I think that's not bad. Let's do taggers. Can this be modified to be an actual guest? Taggars or taggers? No, not really. Unless leggers is a word. No, we don't have an L. Peggers might be a word. Does this fit? Peggers fits. It's not a word. There must be something like this. Ah, oh, it feels so close. Meggers. Weggers. Teggers. Heggers? <laughs> There's huggers, but... Oh, beggars. Beggars is a word, right? Oh, I bet it's 1G or something. Wait. It looks right to me. I don't know why. I don't know why it doesn't accept beggars. Someone in the comments will make fun of me for thinking that's how beggars is spelled, but I mean, oh, maybe it's A R S. Oh, that looks right. Is baggers a word? No, oh, I guess I'd have to do E R S, huh? Ah, unfortunate. Um, daggers. <laughs> no, okay, so we're gonna do taggers. Well, that was very useful. The A goes here. The G is not repeated. So maybe it starts with G, although the G could be here. Actually, putting the G here... Wait, hold on. Maybe the R is doubled, though. And then I put, and then I start with G. Uh, I mean, it's not garage. It could end in E, though. Maybe I end in A-G-E, then. Marriage. No, marriage has an I in it. Could it be ra... Ravage? That's not this one V. Um, Razage. <laughs> Um, all right, carriage. No, that's that has an eye as well. All right, I'm gonna just warage, yarage, parage, darage, harage, jarage. Clearly, uh, I don't, I'm just not trusting myself that these aren't work. Wait, barrage. Oh, okay. I didn't actually figure it out, I just <laughs> fiddled with the letters till it worked. But after seeing it turn green, I immediately realized that it was barrage. 
So there we go. I will have a barrage of comments making fun of me for this solve, but I did get it in three and uh, it was close to being an expert solve. Not quite expert, but this A and E. Unfortunately, I couldn't figure out how to get that working, but um, yeah, I don't, I don't mind this solve. It was pretty fun. How'd you do today? And of course, if you enjoyed this content, then why not leave a like and subscribe?